Before there was Martin Luther King, and before Malcolm X, there was Vernon Johns. Vernon Johns, born April 22, 1892, was a civil rights activist who fought against racism and injustice, and stood up when very few decided not to. He is one of the most forgotten American heroes. Vernon Johns was a preacher at Dexter Avenue, a Baptist church in Montgomery, Alabama. During his time as a preacher there, he made powerful speeches that moved the whole black community to want to take action against racial inequality and protest discrimination at stores and lunch counters. Vernon Johns was so brave that he even sat at an all-white lunch counter by himself in order to be served. Other times, he even convinced people not to ride the bus because of the racial discrimination against black people. Police officers and Ku Klux Klan members would often ride by his home and even destroy his home to intimidate him to stop. Even the church who hired him tried to convince him to stop because they were afraid of what might happen to him or them. But Vernon Johns decided not to and continue his fight against racial inequality. He invited one of his fellow deacons, Deacon Hill, to go with him on a sit-in. And later on that day, after they did the sit-in and were denied service, Deacon Hill was on his way to the grocery store. As he was on his way to the grocery store, he was shot and killed by police officers when he tried to save a black man from getting beat up. After the death of Deacon Hill, Vernon Johns was devastated and hurt and wanted to do more. That following Sunday morning, he made one of the most powerful speeches that one could ever make and moved people in a way that very few preachers have been able to do. Because of his activism, the police department pressured the church to fire Vernon Johns, and they did. Without a job, Vernon Johns had to move him and his family out of Montgomery, Alabama. One of the deacons at Dexter Avenue, a Baptist church, invited Vernon Johns to his house to talk to a young man who was going to be hired as the next preacher. Vernon Johns talked to him about the importance of fighting against racial inequality and injustice. He even gave him some tips and ideas on how to fight it. After that long conversation with that young man, he left Alabama. That young man was Martin Luther King Jr. Hope you liked this video. For more content, please like and subscribe.